What is going on everybody out there in YouTube land? RHC here back with uh, another figure pickup video. And this time it's a flea market uh, finds video. Yeah, I haven't gone to the flea market in a while and bought anything good. I mean, because I just haven't made out there as much as of late. And, I don't know, sometimes with some people at the flea market, it's always kind of hard to find good figures. And, believe it or not, did not find good wrestling figures at the flea market as of late. But since one guy I used to buy my figures from is no longer there, but... There is another guy there who sells a lot of cars, he sells a lot of figures. And I found some awesome Ninja Turtle figures through him, plus I found some Hot Wheels through another seller. So I think I'll show the Hot Wheels first. You know, show off my Mustangs. Got these all for $3.00. Four for three dollars. I mean, that's like getting one for free. So here's a 2007 Shelby GT500, white with blue stripes. That's pretty cool. Then got a 2010 Ford Shelby GT500. I love that silver paint job. That is awesome with the white racing stripes. Then got a 67. Shelby GT500, red with white stripes. I think this one might be one of my absolute faves. <laughs> and then, last one, just a standard Mustang, a 2010 Ford Mustang GT. It's got a little bit of a dark red paint job with some gold stripes. Doesn't really match the card too much, but oh well, whatever, it's still pretty cool. So that's it for my Hot Wheels. Like I said, I picked these up for $3. So you can't beat that. Now let's get into my neutral pickups. So first, I had a hard time finding this guy. Could not find him in retail. I found Mike, I found Leo, found Raph. But I couldn't find Don of the original comic book Ninja Turtles. So here he is. Yeah, I got him at the flea market. Now, believe it or not, I did not pay a lot for him. Now, he, these go for, you know, $9 or so in retail. But guess what? I only paid $5. Can't get it cheaper than that. Especially when some people want, like, God, too much online. I mean, sometimes they want 12 13, 14, 15, 20, or, well, they'll try to be assholes and make you pay out, out of the ass. Now, the seller at the flea market I bought from did not sell it for $5 originally, apparently, because there's another sticker on it. I think he tried to sell it for $10 originally. Yeah, he tried to sell it for 10 but I got for 5 So you can't beat that, so I'm going to take the sticker off it pretty soon and put it up with the rest of my compact turtles. I have Leo, Mike, and Raph, so I'm glad I have Don. But... I will say this right now, that was not my best find at the flea market. While I was at the booth where I got this Ninja Turtle figure at, I found four figures from the from the 2003 Ninja Turtle series. Yep, all four of the 2003 Turtles, the first wave. So, starting off, my favorite, Leonardo. Which, by the way, I have this figure out of the package too, and he's the only one I have of the 2003 figures besides Shredder. Because I kind of missed out the... Missed a chance to get the other 2003 figures when they were released because I was kind of uh, not working as much. Was collecting trading cards mostly and wasn't really collecting figures as much at the time. But still got 2003 Leonardo. Here's his file card. If you want to read it, feel free to pause it. And then we got Raphael, who was my who I believe, who I would say is my second favorite. Also a pretty nice figure back of his file card then because he was just mentioned but obviously he's better to see him more purple than red it's Donatello and once again his file card and of course Kefrit the jokester Michelangelo here he is and of course his file card and as you can see, yeah, I left the stickers on. I paid 15 bucks for these. So 60 bucks for all four is actually not a bad deal in my mind. Especially since these go for like at least $25 to $30 online for, for these figures alone. You know, and then when you factor in shipping, I paid a I paid a much much more, you know, much less, I should say, than I would have if I bought these online. Packaging each one's in decent condition. Yeah, they could be a little better, but Oh well, I'll still keep him in the package anyway. And hopefully I can find Don, Raph, and Mike loose one of these days so I can put it with my Leonardo. Oh yeah, of course, it's the back of the card. But, uh, of course, there's Splinter and Foot Soldier, Shredder. Like I said, I have Shredder, but I just don't have him in on card. But 
Maybe sooner or later I'll find them on card. But that's it. Those are my flea market pickups. My new turtles and some Hot Wheels. I uh, thank you guys for tuning into this video. And, well, hope you all go to the flea market again and find some more figures. Maybe some wrestling figures. Maybe I'll find some more Ninja Turtles. Who knows? Anyways, that's all for now. Rock on and keep collecting.